I just received one of these cryo grip plates for my mini. This is the Glacier. I would like to have had the Frostbite, but I don't think they do them for the Mini, which is strange considering. But anyway, we will give it a go and do some tests. One thing very important, make sure you change the cool plate in the settings on Bamboo Studio. Make sure everything is selected correctly in the settings, such as filament. Then select the file that we are going to use, which is obviously in this case for the test will be the slant in stairs to see how grippy the plate is. Make sure that the plate is changed to cool plate in the settings, because a lot of people don't do it and then they damage their plate. Just check in the settings to make sure everything is okay, but I will leave them as the file intended. Make sure my A1 Mini is selected. Very important. Slice the plate. One quick check and then send it to the printer. I'm printing the suspended stairs in PLA to see how grippy these plates really are. Let's see if it's any good or just a market employee. Using standard black PLA from GTEC. I'll speed the footage up so I don't bore you by watching it in real time. So far so good, seems to be sticking well, I'm printing fine, 30 minutes left, so we'll see what happens. Looking very good, very steep angle, so far so good. I've not tried this with a standard plate yet, but will do because it would be interesting to see what happens. See if these plates are as good as they say. as things seem to come off just as easy as they do on the standard plates.
it has successfully printed OK at the angle without any bracing or supports. The print is finished at the angle, seems to be stuck OK. Broke off. The adhesion wasn't too bad, but it seemed to have worked. Same as before, just going through the settings in Bamboo Studio, selecting Generic Pet G, changing a few strength settings as this is going to be used on a metal detector so I need it quite strong. And then when I'm happy with everything, just click on slice plate. Just check in roughly how long it's going to take. And then send it to the printer. And away we go. G printing perfectly on my bamboo mini. Absolutely amazing quality with PETG or PETG as most people call it. Flawless. These plates are not all they are cracked up to be. The settings are perfect, what they are supposed to be, and what they have been, I've been told by Panda. But it's lifting, you can probably see that paper sliding straight underneath with this PET G. So it's not gripping as good as they try and make out. Obviously if you had a brim it would be fine, but that defeats the object of having this plate. See? So it's still lifting even with these so-called cool plates. Don't waste your money, stick to your normal plate, much better. Yeah, that's extremely disappointing, printing fine, but definitely isn't all in on the plate like it is supposed to. And these are supposed to be super grippy. And this is Pet G, should have no trouble at all. Very disappointing. I bought a cheap plate, £6.50 I think it was from Aliexpress, I'll show you later in the video and you don't even get this problem with it. Not all, they are cracked up to be. Extremely disappointed this didn't stick to this plate very good considering it's supposed to be frostbite cryo grip and now easy did it come off